Roaming Europe correspondent of Al Jazeera English Stephanie Vason at Foreign Policy Committee of Indonesia FPCI public discussion said Ukraine's ongoing conflict against Russia is being waged alongside an internal battle against corruption. Stephanie Faison at the Foreign Policy Community of Indonesia or FPCI public discussion held in Jakarta said Ukraine President Zelensky plans to further crack down on alleged corruption and financial mismanagement within the military. She also said Ukraine is now fully committed to reducing corruption as the country strives for membership in both EU and NATO. So I have lived in uh, Russia for a year as a journalist, as a correspondent for Al Jazeera English and I have traveled to Ukraine. So I could see on both sides uh, what the situation is and I noticed that there's still uh, quite a lot of corruption as well and especially uh, for Ukraine because Ukraine wants to be part of the European Union uh, as a democratic country. So they really have to uh, deal with this and they are dealing with this. Uh, there was this um, report about um, Uk Ukrainian um, recruiters for the army accepting bribes from men who didn't want to go to the front line and President Zelensky has uh, now replaced all these people who have been accepting bribes. But also in Russia, of course, there's also still a lot of corruption. I think these issues are also important to talk about and to notice while this war is going on. Pressure for crackdown corruption has been building within Ukraine, where media and anti-corruption activists have continued to expose scandals, and fight against corruption is almost as important as the fights on the battlefield.